Marine scientists from the Coral Sea Foundation have been studying the reefs at Lizard Island for over 20 years. In April 2014, Lizard Island was affected by tropical cyclone Ita, and in March 2015, it was affected again by tropical cyclone Nathan. In 2016, Lizard Island was at the epicentre of one of the worst coral bleaching events ever seen on the Great Barrier Reef. As a result of these three large disturbances occurring back to back over three years, coral cover around Lizard Island was substantially reduced, particularly amongst the branching corals in the family Acroporidae. One of our research projects at Lizard Island has been looking at the long-term population dynamics of giant clams. In 2017, we surveyed the populations of clams in Watson's Bay, and we noticed hundreds of juvenile corals had settled on the clam shells and were beginning to grow. Our team of Coral Sea Foundation members and citizen science volunteers are combing through this data set, extracting the growth information for all of these juvenile corals. This will give us a fantastic insight into the way the reef at Lizard Island is recovering. This research is ongoing and if you'd like to be a part of it, please get in touch with us here at the Coral Sea Foundation.